For this one, we're going to make a um, locked it folder, kind of like a private folder. However, this folder is not encrypted, so it's just a basic level. So we have our um, a private folder here, right? It's locked, as you can see. And if a normal user tries to access it, it's going to prompt them with this and says, you don't have permission. And as you can see, it doesn't display any of the content of the folder. So to make one of this, um, you can use any folder existing or make a new one, doesn't really matter. Okay. And um, we're going to use this folder, the yummy folder, right? So what you need to do is uh, bust out your terminal. And in your terminal, you're going to use this command here. GKSU Netflix, right? Now this will give us the, the root Netflix thing. Now we got to navigate to our folder, okay? So we navigate to the yummy folder. Yummy folder, right? Now what you're going to do is right here is right click on it and go down to properties. And in properties, you have um permission tab here. And where it says owner, change that to root, okay? Root. And um you see where it says group. This is the normal user. And you don't want them to uh, access it either, so you put none. Same thing with others, you don't want anyone else, so you set that to none. Apply the permission change, okay, and close it off. Now, you don't see any icons that indicates that this is a locked folder because you're in the root, right? If you switch back to the normal one, you see that the icons has been applied, it, which signifies that it's been locked. So you cannot access it if you don't have the permission. Okay. Now, if you want to add like new um, stuff into your yummy folder, see this blank in here right now, right? But if you want to transfer stuff, you have to use the the root. Like let's say uh, this file, put it in here. Say you, you only a, a root user can see it, but if you um, try to uh, do it out here. It's not gonna let you see that. That's why you have to use that root screen only. So that's how you transfer stuff um, or you, like put new shits in there. And um, I really don't know how to um, like you know right here where it's locked it right. I really don't know how to make it so when you click on it, it'll prompt you for the password and then you get in there. So the way around it that I that I do it is. Uh, I make a launcher. See, this is my launcher right here, right? Now, to create a launcher is you can do that for the menus up here too, if you want, if you wish. See these menus, you can do that same thing, but this is the how you do it. Um, right click on your desktop and it says create launcher, right? Now, what you put, uh, put for the name doesn't really matter, but for the command, for the command, um. You type in uh, GKSU Nautilus, and in the path of the the private folder, right? So the private folder was at uh, home slash uh, user slash uh, yummy, right? So you have to, and then you save it, and that's it. That's really all you gotta do. And I already made one, so there's no point in me doing it again. So this is their private folder, right? So whenever I click on it, that's when I want to use the my private folder. Click on it, dude. And you see the password prompt will pop up. If you don't have um, the password, you ain't going to use it. So you see, now we have our folder here that only we can see because we have the password. So that's how you do it. Uh, now there's another way to make the launcher if you wish um, you know the the other way is um, the scripts you know you right click most of you guys seen this before scripts right and then this is my private folder and you see that's another way to do the launcher so that's how you do it um, as uh, I said um, this is a uh, root Natalis. So if you do something in there and you delete something, 
it's not gonna go to the trash can it's gonna delete it so be careful what you're doing in there okay and I think that's about it um, set it up now remember this is not in, in encryption okay someone really wants your data they could but none of my family is no Linux I just, and I don't want them to accidentally go into a folder that you know I don't want them to see and that's about it um, for that